what's going on. Today's video, I am uh, accepted a challenge from John over at 1984 Barbecue. He challenged me on the veggie burger, and uh, I'm not one to turn down a challenge. I'm gonna do it. And the joke's on him because one of my daughters is a uh, vegetarian. So uh, I've got it. Uh, I'm gonna make one of her favorites. It's a quinoa black bean burger with caramelized onions and sweet potato fries. Check it out. All right, guys. So we are gonna get started first on this patty with one cup of refried beans. You can use regular beans, but then you gotta smash them and it's pretty much the same same deal as just the refried. So I just get the refried and they're uh, pre pre-made already. Super easy to do. All right, so you get those kind of laid out in there. Then we got two cups of quinoa. And the quinoa I'm using today is red and white, both mixed together. Okay. You can just use red, it's what I normally use, but I'm all out. So I'm using red and white. To that we're gonna add one half cup of panko breadcrumbs okay add that in there just kind of move that around a little bit all right to that we're gonna add one egg slightly beaten we got that done get that going on all right follow that with one teaspoon of chili powder chipotle chili powder okay one teaspoon of chipotle chili powder followed by one teaspoon or I'm sorry half a teaspoon half a teaspoon of black pepper and half a teaspoon of sea salt I've also got here half a teaspoon of sea salt all right to that we are going to add one clove of garlic that I'm going to run through this garlic press, kind of minced throughout. All right, I'll use my dirty knife. That'll get all of that in there. Okay. And then we're going to just get this going a little bit. So we get our hands dirty with these beans. Just move that all that around. It'll form your patties. And then what we wind up doing is making these patties. And then we're going to put them in the uh, in the fridge for a minimum of half an hour. Got to let them cool. Let them come together. That'll work. All right. Now to this. I'm adding three cups of Monterey Jack cheese. You can use cheddar cheese, you can use really whatever you want. I just had Monterey Jack there, so I'm adding that in here. Gives it a little flavor, but also acts as a, a bit of a binder to it as well. Or as well. That's all the ingredients we need for our patties. Tell you what. Mix that salt in there and that chipotle pepper wasn't a lot, but believe me, it'll, it'll flavor it up, it'll intensify it. All right, let's get these now. Move some of this out of the way over here. Let's see, we can make some patties. want to get a about a quarter pound patty if you will about like so and that's already got a good consistency you can see it's not that sticky but you let it cool just a bit and it's not so bad all right we'll get these done like so. I mean, come on, guys. That don't look too bad, does it? That looks pretty good. Come on. Let's compare to some of the other videos I've seen out there. 
not saying any names, but trust me, super simple easy recipe, and uh, even if you're not vegetarian, give it a shot, I think you'll like it, alright, alright, I get these other two done, or one more done, and I'm going to put them in the fridge, and then we'll come back, and we'll get them on the Blackstone, I'm going to cook them up. All right, guys, we're going to start off with some onion here. I'm going to caramelize these onions. They're going to go on top of the burger. Get that going in just a second. Add some butter to that. One pat for right now. In a little bit. All right, and these onions, they are ready to come off. They're nice and sauteed right where they want to be, right where I want them to be. I'm going to put them in this pan here. Chugging along. Right back and some quinoa burgers on there. Crisp them up. Cook them up. That was a thicker one there, you can tell. saying these onions we're just gonna grill them up a little bit we don't want to burn them a lot of attention to them definitely saute them up clarify them get that good color on them almost ready Been a few minutes. Let's get these boogers a flip. All right, a little char mark there. Oh yeah, you see that? Oh yeah, they're cooking along good. You really want to press them, press them just to even them out. But there's not going to be any juices or anything like that coming out on them. So it'll be alright. Alright, anyway, like that for a few more minutes. Go get some cheese and get them going. Alright, guys. Put these over one more time. Get some cheese on them. Focus in a little closer this time just so you can see how the crust was forming. And I'm sorry if you hear the noise in the background. My neighbor is deciding to cut his grass. As you see me now, I like to just cover it up, steam it up, steam that cheese, 30 seconds, and I'll be ready to take off, get them dressed up, gonna be good, 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 veggie burger, come on now, alright, take a look, oh yeah, we are done, done, done. Get them out of here. I'm going to start here with a layer of cacique cilantro lime with uh, Mexican style with some sour cream. Stuff is really, really good. Tacos, burgers. Just gives another little layer of, of flavor, especially when you're not expecting it. 
just a little bit. Just a little bit, like I say. It'll be good. Alright. So, this bottom bun. I'm going to start with the bottom bun and our patty. And get that out of top of there black bean patty gonna come back with some caramelized onions all right a few laid out and around I'll layer it like that Let's spread it around all right and then we're gonna layer some sweet potato fries on top like so just kind of incorporate them a bit like so like so I'm put one more right there like that sweet potato fries were frozen I actually had them in the uh, in the oven and then we're going to top it off with a fried egg just because why not and that is it pile this on the side I like so alright and that's it get the camera get you another angle and uh, we'll take a test take a taste that's what he tried to say alright guys alright there you go Veggie burger, sweet potato fries, with a fried egg. Alright. Hey guys. Alright, here we go. Veggie burger, black bean burger, quinoa, a little bit of everything you saw it went together. Sweet potato fries, and a fried egg, just because. I'm going to turn it around here and uh, take a bite. Alright, here we go. but very good for that egg went on there it wouldn't be all over the place but one more bite one more bite mm -hmm. very messy as you can see Flavors there. Tell you what, give it a shot. Give it a try. Some water. Give it a try. Oh, it's really good. You'd be surprised. I dare you to try it. Speaking of dares, let me get all this kind of cleaned up, and I come back on who I challenge to do the. Uh, where my next two challenges are going to be the, the next round. All right, guys. Let me get this cleaned up. And we'll finish it up, and I'll come back and talk to you in a bit. Hey guys, what's going on? All right, burger's done. Really, really good. I'm, I'm serious. Good, good recipe. Try it out if you haven't, and you probably haven't. But I'm gonna put the description below, the recipe in the description below, and give it a shot. Uh, also, got to note that in the video I stated I put three cups of cheese in with that patty mixture. It was a quarter cup of cheese, not three cups. Okay. Uh, the two guys I'm going to challenge to do this going forward or going next. Uh, first one is Ryan with Off the Walls Barbecue. Second one is Eric at Camp House Barbecue. You two guys are up. You're next. Hit it out the park. <laughs> we'll catch you on the next one. All right, guys. Later.